Well, yes, it's been a difficult couple of weeks for this community. Many of the residents here have gone from worrying about two of their own, Briar Schmigelski and Cam McLeod, thinking that they were missing, to complete shock upon learning that they were actually murder suspects in the BC murders. Now, since then, it's been tense, many wanting answers as the nationwide manhunt has unfolded and awaiting the fate of the two young men, which, of course, we learned today. It's about time. Glad they got him. I hate to say it, but dead or alive. A well, heartbreaking for the parents, but we can't tell, can we, how the kids will turn out. Now, Port Alberni is actually quite a small city, just roughly 18,000 people. And being thrust into this international spotlight has been difficult. Today, the mayor says this may bring some closure, but it's not the outcome they were hoping for. As a community and, and from the perspective of the city, we are just incredibly saddened by the news. Um, it's not the outcome that we were hoping for. And I mean, there's just been so much tragedy here. Now, as for the Schmigelski and McLeod families, there were several vehicles parked outside of their homes today. No trespassing signs were also posted, along with a notice on one of the doorways that said they are asking for privacy at this time and will not be making any statements to media.